What's good, y'all? It's your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So, Bray Wyatt teases rebrand to win him ahead of WWE contract non complete uh, expiration. So, we all know after you leave WWE, whether they release you or you, you know, your contract ends, you have a 90 days non compete clause with any other company or brand. And then once you're done with that, once the 90 days are up, you can wrestle for any company or brand you want to. And he's teasing his return uh, on Twitter. So we're going to check this out, man. Appreciate all love sport. And let's get right into this article. Former WWE superstar Bray Wyatt 90 day non-compete clause is set to expire Friday, which is today as of me recording this. And it looks like he's preparing to present a new character. Wyatt, whose real name is Wyndham Rotunda, was released by WWE on July 31st and will officially become a free agent on October 29th. On Wednesday, he tweeted two more days as a tease. On Thursday, he followed up by removing the WWE uh, from his social media, apparently indicating that he will be going by Wyndham. Bray Wyatt no longer has WWE on his profile. One more day. This is his official Twitter profile. Revenge is a confession of pain. Business inquiries. This this seems this seems pretty legit. It is not yet known which company Wyndham will sign with, but he's received interest from AEW and Impact Wrestling. I've said this before. I'm saying this again. Him going to Impact, I don't think will have an impact, no pun intended, even though I'm sure it will help out their roster. Impact is not like, I, I mean, people do watch it, but when it comes to WWE and, and AEW, these are the two companies right now that a lot of people are uh, watching, especially in the States. So I do feel like his best option would be to go to AEW. Now, here's the thing. Some people have said AEW is just getting former WWE uh, talent. And, you know, it's going to be overcrowded. A lot of people are not going to be able to get the shine that they deserve. It's basically WWE light. Here's my thing about this. With AEW, I have a little bit more faith that they will treat the characters better. Um, from what I've seen, even with Aleister Black and Cody Rose, a lot of people are iffy on the their, their recent match on Cody going over. But Aleister Black hasn't looked that good since he was in NXT. I know he doesn't go by Aleister, Aleister Black now, but I'm just saying he, he hadn't looked that good since he was in NXT. A lot of these guys hadn't looked that good since they were in NXT. And now they look even better. They're getting appreciated. Their talents are being shown. Their charisma is being shown. And if there's anybody that can benefit from going to AEW out of everybody, it's him. It's it's Bray Wyatt. Well, he won't be known as Bray Wyatt, but it's it's um it's Windham. He would benefit from this more than anybody else because he knows how his character should be. I'm pretty sure Tony Khan. Cody, they have no problems letting him, you know, do his thing with his character, and I think it would be interesting. I think it would be cool. And it also depends on where he takes the character, where he goes with it. I am all for this because I have faith that AEW will book him correctly. If he ever went back to WWE, it would be more or less the same. That's just what it would be. So comment down below. Let me know. Do you guys feel like he's going to go to AEW? Do you guys feel like he's going to go to Impact Wrestling? Are you guys excited to see him back on television soon? Let me know your comments down below. Or do you guys think maybe he should go back to WWE at some point? Right now, I think he needs to separate himself from WWE. Work on, on his career, potentially in AEW. And go from there. And I'm okay with that. I really do wish WWE would have treated him better, would have gave his character the right push from the jump and kept it going. But they, they dropped the ball like they have done with so many others. And hopefully AEW can pick up the pieces and they can get the ball rolling again with Hendel. I, I really don't know how to pronounce his name. I'll be feeling like I'm pronouncing it so wrong. Wind Ham. It's, it's so simple when you read it, but... It's just a unique name, but comment down below. Let me know if you guys are 
hoping he goes to AEW or Impact. And are you guys ready to see him back on television again? Appreciate all love and support. Road to 60K. Appreciate y'all kicking it with me. See y'all on the next one. Peace.